going to be a change in Penn Hills, in Harrisburg. All the people that loved him, you know, he wasn't just state representative. He was Uncle Tony sitting in his seat. <laughs> And that's what I'm going to miss about him. Winona Harper spent years working with State Representative Tony DeLuca on community issues in Penn Hills. She says she had known him since she was a young child, as did former State Rep Dom Costa. Tony was so devoted to his people. I mean, he would call me and say, hey, this guy needs a water heater and he can't afford it. Uh, is there any way we can help him? And that's, you know, just you don't find people like that. There's going to, that's one Tony DeLuca, and we'll never have another one, you know? DeLuca's oldest grandson says he was so committed to the Penn Hills, Plum, Verona, and Oakmont communities that he served that he was voting remotely up until just before his death. And young Anthony DeLuca says his grandfather passed that commitment to them. He always instilled in us uh, reaching out and helping others. Uh, you know, I always remember that uh, he, there was a senior uh, Christmas uh, sing-along. Uh, it's one of the things that he did. So he had all the grandkids went up there, we helped them serve dinner and, you know, just, just giving back to the community. At age 85, Tony DeLuca was running for re-election. His name will remain on the ballot, but his seat will be filled by special election. In Penn Hills, Marcy Cipriani, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Marcy, thank you. The Speaker of the Pennsylvania House says Tony DeLuca's legacy will live on in state government. Republican Brian Cutler said in a statement, DeLuca's unwavering commitment to his district could never be questioned, and his efforts on behalf of all Pennsylvanians, in, in particular children, as the Democratic chair of the House Insurance Committee, will have an impact for many years to come. And we got this statement from Allegheny County Executive Rich Fitzgerald on Tony DeLuca. He says, quote, his work ethic was rewarded election after election as the people of his district knew he was always working for them. His annual picnic in Penn Hills Park was always a highlight of the political season and was attended by governors, U.S. senators and national and statewide figures. Visitation for Representative DeLuca will be held Wednesday from 2 to 8 at Gross Funeral Home in Penn Hills. A funeral mass at St. Joseph Church in Verona is scheduled for Thursday.